Hello everyone. So you know, if you know anything about me, that I do not like the taste of coffee. Um, but I like the caffeine in it. This coffee does not taste like coffee. It tastes like chocolate. It's got 13 grams of protein in it. So if you're not a breakfast person, I've got you. Um, and it's frothy and it's creamy and it's delicious. Um, we're talking sweet, like eight sweeteners sweet coffee uh, i wish i had known this sooner i've used no protein powder at all um it's all liquid so yeah if you want to know how i made this keep watching so we've got four sweet text sweeteners in here whatever sweetener you like now i hate the taste of coffee so i use these and i'm using four of them and i just put a little bit of boiling water in there for them to dissolve they will then dissolve with a stir i've got my arachino four here um, and i'm just going to weigh out my milks so this coffee will give you around 13 13 and a half grams of protein the pod i'm using is a volteso pod it is a single espresso shot i'm going to pop that in there i'm not going to start it yet because um I want to get the milk half sorted first and that will just pour into this Nespresso double cappuccino cup. Right, so here's the milk I'm using. I'm using two milks. This is the Alpro Plant Protein Chocolate Powder, uh, chocolate flavoured milk. It's the one with 50 grams of protein per pack. We're going to use 200 grams of this or 200 millilitres which will give you 10 grams of protein, okay? Per 100 grams, it's got five grams of sugar, which is not too bad. Now, I'll fill this up to the max line, which is about 200 mils, thereabouts. Okay, so it's just over 200 mils. The second milk I'm gonna use is this vanilla one from Alpro as well. Um, this has 6.8 grams of sugar per 100 grams, so it's a little bit higher. It's not horrendous, um, but it's got three grams of protein as well. So the chocolate milk with this will give you 13 grams of protein. Well, it'd be a little bit more, I'll work it out exactly in a minute, um, based on how much you use. So I'm just gonna measure some of that out. And then I'll just pour. So I think that looks about 100 grams to me. It's a bit more than that, so we'll put some more back in. And it's a clean glass, so it's not really a problem. There we go. About 100 grams is there. And then that's your milk's done. And I'll give you 13 grams of protein. Now I have an Arachino 4 whatever you use to warm up your milk or froth it. And if you're having iced drinks, then you don't need to warm it up, but it's winter, so I'm having it hot. So I'm just gonna press this one and that's gonna get to work. Also do, because again, like I said, I like it really sweet. And I'm not sure if this is going to be necessary because I've only been using this recipe for about three days, but I do like to use um, a vanilla syrup this one is the morning this is a five mil spout and i do about half the pump there we go about half the pump in there just for a little bit of vanilla flavorings that's that the chocolate milk's now done so we're going to pour that into here of course it seems rather chaotic because i'm trying to film at the same time normally it wouldn't be this difficult so i just pour that in the boiling water in here like that and at this point I will then start my espresso so that the coffee doesn't go weird and that's just going to fill up in there and then we're going to pour this straight in here because it's going to mix together anyway and put that on the foaming setting yes there is about breakfast I just let that do sound here is the chocolate milk. And just get a little spoon. It's actually a straw, not a spoon. I don't know what I'll put a spoon. I'm just going to mix that. My coffee shot is now done. 
which is great. I've had time to be patient with that. I'll pop that in there like that. And then we're going to wait for the vanilla to be done and pop that on top as a foam. And that's it. 13 grams of protein in your morning coffee and it tastes super sweet. So here is our foam. Look at that. Oh, my Lord. Hello, heaven. Hello, heaven. And that's why I use the vanilla because it creams really well. And as you can see, there's a perfect amount for the cup. Beautiful. How beautiful.